I will create original oil painting based on this digital study made in Procreate. Hello everyone, if you don't know me, I'm Foxiness and welcome to my enchanted studio. So, after transferred my drawing to the board, I'm starting to apply gold leaf and after it dried, I started to, to create underpainting using just two pigments, uh, which will help me to, to create value structure for the painting. I'm adding more intricate details to her dress and also paint chain and I wanted to have a lot of texture. So I'll use uh, old brushes to paint her hair. I will cover with another paint layers this layer, but nevertheless it's very important step for me when I'm painting. So underpainting is finished and dried and now I can apply transparent layer of color on top. Just the beginning and color will change with each layer a bit. And when I move to her face, I'm working in small areas and try to catch value and hues in her face. It's nice to have variation in skin. Some parts need to be more saturated and another one more great. It's probably second uh, session of painting. I'm correcting values in her face to make it look more 3D. First I paint big uh, planes and then move on to small one. I really love to paint hair. It can give a lot of dynamic to your character and even help to convey emotional state. Now I paint stars and the night nice sky will take me a few layers to paint. Basically, I paint stars, then I wear another transparent layer of blue pigment and repeat it again, so it will create um, a really beautiful effect of depth. And it will not look very contrasty. And I really love uh, the effect which texture gives in hair. It's very beautiful and I want to uh, use it more in my next paintings. Basically with each wear you add more and more details and it, it is very important to add those details on good base. So you probably need to spend more time on your first wear or first two wears and then everything will go very smoothly. Last details to her. And now I will let the painting curl for probably a few months. And after that I will add temporary varnish, which will increase glow. And of course a little bit of magic dust. So this is how finished painting looked like. It took me a lot of hours to make, but I'm very happy with finished result and hope you enjoy the process as well. 
And if you have any questions or suggestions or just like the video, please leave the comment below. And of course, subscribe and ring the bell. And see you in next episode. Bye-bye.